We're going hiking right now. It's early. We slayed the hike, five miles round trip. I think it's 1,500 feet in elevation. Easy peasy, baby, easy peasy. Now we're gonna get some pokey. Pokey bowl, baby. This has never happened to me in my life. These sunglasses just split in half while I was wearing them, just fell off. Just nose shattered through the middle. That is bonkers. Look at this. Look at this stuff. Just, just right down, right down the middle, huh? In two miles, take exit 55 BC onto Wilshire Boulevard. <laughs> That's pretty bad. Look at this bug eye. Bug eye sunglasses. My friend that I go hiking with, he bought me Pokey. And this is the first time I've ever had it. I've had, I've tasted it, but I've never had had a true meal, ever had my own meal here. So we're gonna give it a go. This survived an hour of LA traffic. It looks like it's still doing pretty, pretty good here. I'll tell you what I did and I'll tell you where I think I may have missed the mark so far. Obviously I've never had it, so we're in it together. I got octopus and I got tuna. Those are the two I got. Got some avocado in here, some rice, edamame, masago, little fish eggs. And then at the end, I got fried onion and fried seaweed, but they also had fried garlic that I didn't get. And that's where I think may, maybe I've missed the mark here, but everything else looks good. Take a peek, take a peek for yourself. You see that? Then on top of that, let me back up for you. On top of that, this man got me a royal milk tea. You're you're bulling with royalty right now. I'm not gonna drink all of it though. It's got 21 grams of sugar. It's kind of a lot. It's kind of a it's kind of a hefty boy on the Azucar side. It's a little bit of Spanglish for you. I take the first bite with chopsticks, so you know it's real. And then I'm gonna switch to the fork so I can enjoy it. That's just the way it is. I went to China once and Thailand. So I'm doing, I gotta do, I gotta do, do it justice. Where do we start? This looks like some crab meat as well in here. All right, I'm gonna grab a piece of tuna, a little bit of crab meat. Oh, I got onions in here too. And then I'm gonna double down with some octopus as well. I'm gonna go for one more before I give a formal review. No, this is deep, nice and the. It's good, a lot of flavor, good flavor, a little bit of zang. There's some zang on this. Oh yeah, I got some sort of sauces on here. Beats me, brother. It's delicious. This is like uh, this is like if you took all the things you want in a sushi bowl and you just threw it in a bowl. That's what it is, right? Am I wrong about that? Let me crack open the tea for you. Let's see if I got a shake for the finest blend of black tea infused with 25% milk. All right, okay. This looks like a non non shake kind of deal. Hmm. I'm gonna phone call, but I'm gonna ignore it just for this. It tastes as described. It tastes like black tea with milk in it, and it is very good. It's like, I could, I could definitely pound that. It's a product of Japan right there. Wow. Yeah, this is a good meal. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say solid. Solid on the rating. Wow. Man, my hope, my world has opened up. I got a whole new genre of food here to keep in, keep in touch with. Bye-bye. I wanna give one last update on this. It is bomb. It is bomb. The deeper I get into this, this is delicious. I've gone a long time without this. This is this is this is something I didn't know I needed. All right, diving into this week's podcast edit. It's got to have a quick turnaround time. Got to edit it, get it to Grant. Grant's got to mix and master it, get it back to me, and we have to upload it before it goes live tomorrow at six a.m. So that's that's the magic. Just a little behind the scenes here. We're still working in Reaper, and in Reaper we are doing video as well. So we're editing video and audio all in one place, which is not, you know, not, not wild, but Reaper is more 
more audio heavy. So that's what we that's what we've been working on lately. It's our workflow. Popping back in here to say I'm halfway halfway done. I'm halfway done with the, the podcast edit. I'm at the 31 minute mark. I don't know if you can see that. I started at 214. It is 450. So do the math. 45, that's three, another hour, 45, two hours and 45 minutes. I'm only halfway done. There's one thing about these podcast edits. It's that they get longer every week. Every week they get longer. And I think, I don't know if it's because I'm like, I have to have this, I have to have this be perfect, uh, which is probably, it's probably bad, you know, in the, in a world of quantity, where's quality left to be. So <laughs> I should just blaze through these, but I can't help it sometimes. And sometimes I'm like, ah, just let a couple of things slip to here, a little bit of that. So that's the update. The next sales call is in, is that 5.30? So that's, do the math. It's 40 minutes. So I have about 30 minutes to finish 30 more minutes. And that first 30 minutes took me two hours and 45 minutes. So do the math. It's going to be a long one. I do need to finish it by then though. Parkinson's Law which is whatever time you've allotted for a task, that's how long the task will take. Parkinson's law. It's also, basically, I, I, I equate it to the procrastination law. But that also doesn't determine the quality of the Parkinson's law. In Parkinson's law, let's talk about it. If you say it's going to fit within this task, that's usually true, but does the quality maintain? Had you had longer time? <sighs> also, I've been pounding black teas because I'm not drinking coffee. I don't know if I mentioned this, still not on the coffee. So I haven't, I haven't had a cup of coffee since December 31st. So, so since January 1st, I've been clean. No alcohol, no coffee, haven't had any candy. I'm candy sober too. No ice cream, ice cream sober. That's not true. I did have one scoop in the past X amount of days, but I only had one scoop, which is good for me because I'm more of a gallon or nothing kind of guy. So I've been pounding these black teas and these black teas, I got the decaf. I know it sounds like I'm talking fast, but I'm not. This is uncaffeinated. Decaf, and I put a little bit of other milk tea in the tea, so I had two of those. I had two of those. It's really keeping me going. Something about having a nice warm drink while you're editing, that's just, it's peaceful. It's good to be back in the post-production side that I find myself here every single week. It's good to be back in the same spot every week. It's 520. My bet is, I haven't looked at this guy's application for the sales call, but my bet is that he will not show up. That's what I think. That's my take. You can say, why do you think that? Uh, I think that because he scheduled a call, but he did not accept his own calendar invite. So he scheduled the call, but he didn't accept the calendar invite. It's kind of like, he doesn't really care. That's what I think. Oh, this is a repeat guy. Oh, this is a follow-up call. Yeah, there's no way he's showing up. He did not show up, I was correct. I also had another meeting earlier today that was not a sales call, it was just a, it was, it was a meeting, a meeting meeting. That's, uh, I won't say what they do, but they also, they, they like hit me up and was like, I'm running late and I was like, all right, no problem. And then I was like, you know, too many minutes passed and I bounced. I was like, that's weird. Like just say, just say you need to reschedule. You know, if you're going to be super late, I've been trying to be more on top of like, if it's five minutes past, just immediately canceling the meeting and rescheduling. Cause if you wait any longer than that, you're, everybody's wasting their time. It's a waste of time. So I've been trying to do a hard line in the sand on that. I think for the other, the other guy, I waited eight minutes though. At the eight minute mark, I was like, dude, let's just reschedule. Upload is commencing. It's 552. So then once these are uploaded, Grant will get them, make some master them and then send the uh, the mixed version to me. I will take that version of the audio and place it under the, the video and render two things, an audio and a video after that. So uh, we're still we're still going. This is this is just for one episode. So I hope you enjoy. I hope you mother freaking like it. I hope you like this stuff. I hope it makes you feel good. We got the protein shake brewed up. Quick little breather. Little Fortnite sesh with the boys. By boys, I mean one man. The Kyle Five Rod. I'm still thinking about getting a workout in. Thursdays are, are the deadlift days that I mentioned yesterday. It was actually arms yesterday. There's still so much left to do. 
I still got to reach out to podcast guests, upload the podcast, make the thumbnails for the podcast, chop up the podcast. I got to send a couple emails. I got to prep for my first meeting tomorrow. That's at 10 a.m. You don't really, I don't even know if you're interested in this. Are you interested in hearing about another man's work day? What a, what a man does for work? I got mail though. You got mail. Two dubs on the night. Two dubs, two second places, one third place. That's a good night. All right, time to get time to get back to it. Nothing like getting some dubs to just get you going, you know? Get you ready for some more late night work. It's 11.25 p.m. I can feel the bags in my eyes just yanking down, getting aggressive with. The weight is increasing, but the episode is about to be scheduled. One button click away. Schedule upload. Boom. Oh man, and I still have to post it on YouTube. Gah. I lied. No, I'm not even done yet. I've been writing some emails late late at night recently. Just been just been because I you know I don't I don't love writing emails, to be honest. It's not my favorite thing to do. Admin work is not my forte per se. So they just get piled up and then at the end of the day I'm like, you know what? Might as well do them. And then that's what I do them. I do them late. I don't know if I always, I don't know if the, I don't know if the verbiage is correct. You know, the grammar stays intact. I just, and then I just let her fly. You know, I just let it rip. So I guess I'll see you on the other side, Captain.